Welcome to your heart healthy resistance training workout. Eight minutes to firm your muscles. Let's get started. The first exercise is to touch out and in. We're now using the upper back muscles as well as our legs. We're gonna work all the major muscle groups and firm and tone specific ones. This is targeted for your upper back. Can you feel that when you stretch your arms back there? That's it. Good. If you don't have weights, go ahead and grab some cans of soup or whatever you have. But I'm using light weights, three pound weights. You can work up to five to 10, whatever you have at home. Just get them out and let's firm up those muscles. Resistance training is so important. It improves our heart health, it improves our muscle structure, and the most important, it helps to improve your overall metabolism. Muscles work miracles on our metabolism. Let's all stay heart healthy. That's it. We got two more of these. Just touch and push out. That's it. Touch. Good. Last one. Beautiful. Now turn to the side. We're going to lift our elbows behind us and we're going to tap. That's it. Just on one side. Good. If you're just starting out with me, just start like this. One arm at a time. There. Push out and in. Resistance training really helps to firm those muscles. Strength training builds strength. This also helps our bones to stay healthy. That's right, touch and come back. Take your time. Slower motion is nice. It makes the muscle do the work without momentum. We got one more. Great, and let's go to the other side. Bring your elbow up, tap back, and push up. That's it, good. Start to feel this in the back of your arm. That's it, the triceps. One of the most underused muscles in the body. Just tap and lift. That's it, you're doing it. This is too complicated to do both. Just hold it right here and reach out and in. That's great. We're really target toning the back of those arms right now. Good. And tap, we've got two more of these. Last one, beautiful. Okay, let's do some bicep curls. Stretch and tone here. Bicep and release. Notice it's a full range of motion. All the way down and all the way up. Squeeze at the top, squeeze at the top. Working those beautiful arms, that's it. Resistance training really works. It helps firm those muscles. If you have a band, you could use that at home. Whatever you have to really challenge the muscle, that way you really help develop your muscles. If we lose our muscle, it's not good for us as we age. That's it. So you gotta use it or you'll lose it. <laughs> if you recline, you decline. So let's work those muscles. Good, two more. I love these bicep curls. They keep my arms nice and firm so it doesn't droop or sag. As we age, we're trying to fight that gravity. Good, last one. Okay, let's now work on our shoulders. Shoulders are so important as we age because they help us with posture. You're gonna do a beautiful medial deltoid muscle. This is working through the front of your shoulder. But make sure when you're doing this, your back is straight, your knees are slightly bent. That helps protect the low spine. Thinking about good posture, bring it up here, just shoulder level. That's all you have to go on this one. You'll start to feel that. You're doing great, we got one more. And now we double it up, out to the side and one in front. This is now working a different muscle of the arm and shoulders. Beautiful, just lift and load. As your tummy in, engage those ab muscles. Core muscles are very important. That's right, we got two more of these. Last one, beautiful. Okay, let's take it down to the floor. I want you to reach this one foot behind you, hook in your weight to the back and let's work on the buttocks. Lift and lower, you could come down to your elbows if you like, whatever makes you more comfortable, but you're lifting up. This is really working the back of your thighs and buttocks to lift and tone, that's it. We all need that. We don't want that rear end to go south. We want to make it lift, 
Lift that buttocks, yes. And as you lift it, hold it up this time. Push it up, baby pulses. That's it, stomach is in. Don't let your back droop or sag. That's it, you're doing great. Hold it up there, hold it up. Up, 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 up. Okay, beautiful. Just take this out now. And now slowly lift your body weight all the way up and hold a plank right now. I love to put my weights just like this because it helps my wrists. Otherwise, you can just place it just like a plank, hands right in front. I like the lift it gives me. Great. Hold, 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 and release. Okay, let's go to the other side. Remember, do the best you can. If you don't want to place this weight here, just do the exercise without the weight. And slowly come down on that elbow. All you're doing is lifting your heel up and back down. Beautiful lift. Squeeze your buttocks at the top. That way you lift the buttocks. Look great in your pants, your jeans. That's it. We really want to keep our nice shape of the buttocks. And this is what really helps. A little resistance training goes a long way, I promise. This time we take it up and we do little baby pulses. Keep squeezing that weight in there. That way it works the buttocks as well as your hamstrings. So good. Last two, come on, get it up there. Up, 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 up. Beautiful, and come on down. This time I want you to go onto your backs. Just relax your back now and slowly go on your back. Now I want you to hold the weights in front of you. We're gonna open up and we're gonna close. This is called a chest fly. We're firming the chest muscles, so important. Now as you do this, I want you to try one more exercise. That way we make our time more efficient. What we're doing is tapping down and up, and down and up. Now we're engaging the abs, but make sure the back is staying right down on the ground. Make sure the small of the back stays on the ground. You can do one arm at a time now. Either way, you're getting your chest and your lower tummy tighter. <laughs> Good, last one, and release. Placing the weights right behind you, in front right here, holding your wrist there, and lift and lower. You can do with knees bent to protect your back, but this is working the tummy. Can you feel it? Oh, I sure can, I love this one. Lower tummy tightener. We got two more, last one, and roll her all the way up, and let me see your gorgeous smiling face. You did it. We'll be nice and heart healthy with some resistance training. Thanks for working out with me, woo! If you love this workout, I have so much more at deniseaustin.com. Try my free trial that you get to do all kinds of different workouts and recipes, eating plans, you will love it. All you have to do is visit deniseaustin.com, sign up for your free trial now.